Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm here to share what I have made for the 2022 Jewelry Making Fun collab. Uh, we upload on the 18th of each month at noon. And it's hosted by Dolly Designs Jewelry and More, which is Deb Houck. Um, for the month of June, we were to use the colors red, white, and or blue. So any combination of that. We could choose to incorporate pearls, mother of pearl, or shell if we wanted to. That was option number one. And number two, <clears throat> we could try a, t a knotting technique if we wanted to do something like that. I chose just to stick with the collars because I did pearls in another recent collab. And um, I just didn't feel like using any pearls in this one. Plus the white that I used kind of looked... Actually, the red, all these beads, I believe the red and the blue are actually pearls from that I got from Joann's last year. So I guess I kind of did use pearls in this challenge. Um, let me see, what was I going to say? My mind just went blank. <laughs> okay, I don't know. Um, but here is a um, necklace that I have created for this collab. I used a, just a rant, like a mix of these red, white, and blue beads. I believe I used the same set, the same assortment last year for the same um, collab. I don't remember if it was June or July when we had the colors red, white, and blue. It might have been May, I don't remember. Uh, sometime during the year last year. And these were just still in the little container where I just left them mixed together. And it had this um, heart in here, which is absolutely gorgeous. And I believe I purchased that last year as well from Joann's. Now, these white beads, I'm not exactly sure where they came from. <clears throat> but um, they were just in that, in mixed in with the red and the blue. So, um, now these kind of spacer tubes... Um, I believe they might have come from Beadbox Bargains. <clears throat> I'm not for sure. But these little silver balls are from Beadbox Bargains. Um, the daisy spacers are just from some that I got from Hobby Lobby. And so, there's the, the pendant, which I absolutely love. And I just made a, um, little pattern of the white. And I did, um kind of book in the white beads with daisy spacers and then just a little silver ball and then blue red and blue I just repeated that pattern and then at the end <clears throat> I just crimped put a um, crimp bead flattened a crimp bead to the end of my bead wire and then covered it with this little crimp cover <clears throat> added just the tiniest bit of chain and then ended with a this really pretty turn it around here this really pretty heart toggle since I had the nice um, the beautiful heart pendant I thought I would kind of tie in with the heart toggle so that is the necklace that I have created absolutely love this necklace it's about 14 inches from the clasp all the way down to the point of the heart and that's the length that I really love I don't like super long necklaces <clears throat> so I really love the the length of that I'll be definitely be wearing that this coming July the 4th um, for a bracelet I just made this simple little <clears throat> beaded bracelet I used a magnetic clasp and then just created this pattern um, with the red and then five blue beads five of the blue pearls and then spacers on each side then I just used um, <clears throat> the other two of those really beautiful spacers. Um, it came with four in the package. There, so I used two on the necklace and then just used the last two on the bracelet. And then used the white beads right in the middle. <clears throat> so I really love how that um, pattern looks. I think it's super pretty. And then I just made a simple pair of earrings since, you know, I was making a set. Um, <clears throat> use some of the larger white beads like in the bracelet and just um, kind of did bookends with those bead caps on each side of the white of the white beads and I just did it in the order red white and blue 
and <clears throat> just use some more of those daisies and little um, daisy spacers and little silver balls and I think that is a super fun and cute little pair of earrings it's def definitely very easy to make those went together in like two seconds so <clears throat> there is my set that I have created for this month um, in the jewelry making fun collab <clears throat> Uh, everyone who is, else who is participating, they will be linked down in the description below. So please go and check them out and see what fun, um, if they made a patriotic type piece, or maybe they came up with a creative way <clears throat> to use red, white, and blue that didn't look like, you know, didn't scream patriotic. I'm always <clears throat> interested to see how the other people, you know, use the colors that were given. So, thank you so much, everyone, for stopping by, and hope you all have had a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.